you know, early on, this was a guaranteed maximum price project, which means that we had to have pricing back from the contractors at an early stage. We didn't have all of the drawings done. We didn't have the design done. So for us, it was very beneficial to hand over our digital model and say, please look at this and look at what we've designed so far. The architecture of this is, is unlike anything I've seen before. They came with all of their people. They talked about how they would construct this. They understood the design. They understood the complexities of the geometry. Their involvement in use of technology, their superintendents having iPads in the field, everything just leaps and bounds went forward. Our proficiency in BIM played a huge role in us being a part of this project. Bringing that model, that 3D model in is not only beneficial to the customer, but I've seen the benefits to our people in the field. Traditionally, they're looking at two-dimensional plans and trying to picture it in their head. They're now looking at a 3D representation uh, of what they're building, so they have a way better understanding and uh, they know what they're going to build. We knew that we wanted a, a perforated metal ceiling that was undulating multiple, multiple directions. This building has a ceiling in it that's never been done before. We didn't necessarily know what the suspension system was like. We didn't know what the end result was going to look like. We just had an image in our minds and we had a digital model. Baker was able to take that 3D model and take our vision and actually work with it, construct it, cut it up, and really analyze what we had designed. They shot points two foot on center in the lobby area. They used their total station machine to lay all that stuff out. There's over 10,000 points. There were thousands of points on that ceiling roof that they had to shoot in, and they used that technology for that. To the best of my knowledge, Baker Triangle was the first drywall company, drywall and plaster company, to use total station layout. We also have a, uh, a theater, which has some very complex forms. They're, they're curving in two dimensions. They ultimately looked at using the BIM model, slicing it up, pressed out sheet metal templates, brought those in and constructed those segments inside the building, and uh, the theater came to life from that point. You actually saw the true form of what the architect was really intending to do. They took this kind of kernel of an idea that we had and really turned it into just reality that's actually much more than we ever expected. Using the BIM model and creating those pressed panels was a use of technology that we hadn't seen before in the industry. I think the distinctiveness for us, it's a culture of being creative. It's a culture of always looking at our clients and saying how can we better fit their needs and really thinking many times for our clients and, and what we can offer them that separates it besides price. What's the best way to construct something economically and still get what the owner was looking for? And that's one thing that Baker Triangle was able to provide to us. They were truly partners beside us through this whole journey. When you get people like that in your team, you want to try to work with them as much as possible because going through this process can be, it can be challenging and difficult. And some people just never quite get that process. They get it. And when they saw the, how complicated and the geometry was to this project, they absolutely stepped up to the plate and did their homework. They understand where technology is. They know how to use technology. Every building is a one-off. You know, you never have a chance to get to build it again. So, uh, you know, it's, it's refreshing to work with people like Baker. It really is. Mm -hmm.